Lady Sarah Armstrong Jones was born on 1st of May 1964 at Kensington Palace to Princess Margaret and Anthony Armstrong Jones, 1st Earl of Snowdon. She spent her childhood at Kensington Palace, the marriage of her parents didn't work out and they separated when she was 12 and divorced when she was 14. She spent a lot of holidays at Sandringham and Balmoral where she painted the landscape as she's a professional painter. The Queen was extremely fond of Lady Sarah as she was her only niece. Lady Sarah and her cousin King Charles III have always had a great bond and dare I say he's her favourite cousin. Despite the huge age difference, they always seem to get along really well. Of all her cousins, it is King Charles who Sarah is said to remain closest to. The pair are said to enjoy spending downtime painting together at Balmoral when the opportunity arises. Sarah was a chief bridesmaid at Charles and Diana's wedding and is also a godmother to his younger son, Prince Harry. Sarah spent two years in India with her father as he was employed there to photograph the production of A Passage to India. When spending time in India, she met Daniel Chatto, her future husband. They married on 14th of July 1994 at St. Stephen's Walbrook in London, a beautiful church designed by the renowned architect Sir Christopher Wren, which held just 200 guests. It was the first time that the venue had been chosen for a royal wedding. Lady Sarah arrived with her father, the Earl of Snowdon, and her bridesmaids. Young Zara Phillips was one of her bridesmaids as well. For her wedding dress, Lady Sarah turned to Jesper Conran, very much the in-demand society designer of the time. The timeless design was made from layers of ivory georgette fabric with a square cut, corseted bodice and long sleeves. She wore the Snowdon floral tiara, which had been a gift from her father to her mother on their wedding day. Made up of three floral diamond brooches, the pretty headpiece was accentuated further with a few blooms woven through it. The simplicity of the 30-minute service caught everyone by surprise. Even the driver was not in his place when the couple exited the church, causing them to stand outside for a few minutes waiting for their ride. Although the ceremony was very private, there are so many wonderful shots the photographers outside did a wonderful job capturing her in her wedding gown, tiara and a long veil. She looked so angelic and made such a gorgeous bride. Her wedding gown was just wow and I love the bridesmaids bouquets of pink flowers. After the wedding ceremony, the reception was held at Clarence House, which was hosted by her grandmother, Queen Elizabeth. Among the guests were the entire British royal family including the Queen, Queen Mother, the Prince and Princess of Wales, and for the first time with the family, Prince Edward's girlfriend, now wife, Sophie Rees Jones. The couple have two children, Samuel born in 1997 and Arthur 1999. Arthur also served as a page of honour to the Queen, his great aunt from 2009 to 2015. As Lady Sarah is godmother to Prince Harry, Charles is also godfather to Sarah's elder son, Samuel. Sarah isn't a working member of the royal family, but attends big and important events like Easter service, jubilees, coronation, weddings, etc. And there we go. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, share and subscribe to the channel. And as always, thank you so much for watching.